in this video, we will learn how to use a mirror feature. A mirror feature mirrors individual geometric features that have been united to a base piece of geometry. What we have to do first is to create a sketch that we will be extruding and then we will be creating the mirror of that specific feature. This is really helpful if you have asymmetric pieces, so you only have to draw the half of it. So we select on plane. And then we're going just to create a random figure. Click finish a sketch and then we're going to create an extrusion. Let's give a value of 3. Now we're going to insert a hole over this figure. You can find the mirror fissure on insert, then go to associative copy, and then go to mirror geometry. The first thing that you have to do is to select the object. You have to be really, really careful because when you select the object and you just click on the solid part, it will only mirror that solid part. So in this case, because we have a hole on the figure, then you have also to click that hole. So it can mirror that hole also. And here we're going to specify a plane. A plane doesn't necessarily mean that it has to be on the XY plane or the X plane or XY plane. It could be any part of the geometry that you just created. In this case, we're going to use this face as the plane. And then just click OK. And this is your final geometry. Now, if you select this part, it will only select the half of it, only the half that you mirror. Or if you select the part that you just created, it will only be the half. If this is a whole part, then you have to go to Unite and select the body that you want to unite, like this. Now, if you see here is a line that is dividing both parts, once you click OK, the line will disappear because now it is only one part. Thank you very much for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe.